video i'm going to do a review and test of uh, dream skin moist and perfect cushion of dior i have it in shade uh, number two it's just a little bit too light for my skin but it's not really visible so i can only see it myself um, so i'm going to open this one it has uh, this pad with it which i already used it a couple of times and then um, you can open it like this here you will see the cushion here and then you just uh, press and when you press the cream comes out of this cushion it it has a really nice uh, flower smell as well it's not uh, too sharp um, okay so now I have some cream here I'm going to use it on my skin now I have only moisturizer I am on my skin so I'm going to use it now let's see so I use it on right side of my face I also use it under my eyes as well This one has also SPF 50, which is great. So it's like a mixture of um, sunscreen and really light foundation. It's really, really uh, light foundation. It doesn't have too much coverage. So it just uh, gives you a natural look. Okay, so I apply another layer here. I have a combination skin and um, this one doesn't feel oily or dry so it's uh, really perfect actually okay let's have a look now I have it on right side of my skin I come a bit closer to the camera that you can see and here on the left side you will see so on this side it has um, it covers a bit of uh, pores but it looks really natural it's it's a bit light for my skin but okay it's acceptable okay now i'm going to use it for all over my face on the left side as well and then I'll come back to you uh, after eight hours that you see how it looked like on my skin. I really like this cushion because it has SPF 50 and um, you don't need to use sunscreen under your foundation and it looks really natural. That's, uh, it's like you didn't use anything. So it's really good for daily usage if you go to work. Okay, now I have it all over my face. And I'll come back to you after 8 hours.